Until recently, the approach to optimizing a display connected to Mac OS left a significant amount of uncertainty. Typically, one would start with the display and create an ICC profile that informed the system of the display's parameters. At this point, the task would be considered completed, but this process doesn't account for the actual signal path from the application to display. It doesn't account for the source or the color managed workflow. With patterns for Mac OS, we introduced a whole new approach to the quantification, calibration, and validation of displays driven by the operating system. The ability to create test images in both SDR and HDR color spaces brought the ability to test the entire signal path. While this testing has been revolutionary, it has also been limited to the desktop, leaving an uncomfortable level of uncertainty in the mobile space. Now, we're introducing Patterns Mobile and bringing the power of Patterns for Mac to both iOS and iPadOS, and with it, the ability to quantify and validate the iPhone and iPad's accuracy for content creation and consumption. And for devices with reference mode, Patterns Mobile allows fine-tuned calibration to be performed and validated in virtually any color space. Upon launching Patterns, the user is greeted with the familiar splash screen from Mac OS. To ensure the user interface doesn't interfere with the pattern accuracy and display performance, the interface is hidden and prompted by an arrow at first launch. To reveal it, simply swipe up. You'll see the collection of test patterns available in the carousel. Movement is fluid and intuitive. Selecting a pattern instantly renders it on screen. For a description of the pattern, tap the question mark. To close, press the question mark again. If a pattern is customizable, options are located below the carousel. Pressing the CIE icon brings up the color space selector, allowing the user to choose the standard they wish to test. And if your target is not in our predefined list, selecting custom color space provides the ability to create an entirely new one. This provides a level of versatility elusive until now. Tapping on the gear icon reveals the settings menu. Here, you can select the bit depth of the user interface as well as find the IP address for connecting to third-party applications or accessing the web user interface remotely. When using a pattern generator, we often have two fundamental questions. What is the standard and what am I trying to test? While the color space selector sets the standard, the patterns define the test. The 2D gradient produces a continuous color map, also referred to as a color ramp or a color progression. It illustrates the transition between two or more colors. The configurator below allows for an infinite amount of gradients, an excellent way for assessing bit depth through the system. The alignment pattern is used to place your measurement device at the center of a window. The brightness pattern is used to set black level. If brightness is set low, shadow details will be lost. If it is set high, image contrast is reduced. This pattern is symmetrical and consists of a black background with vertical rectangles from center to side, with a shallow ramp along the bottom. The checkerboard is most often associated with ANSI contrast, or static contrast, where both black and white are simultaneously presented on a display. The configurator allows for infinite customizations of patches, colors, and luminance. The circle gradient consists of the primary and secondary colors from black to fully saturated white, allowing for a quick assessment of quantization or bit depth of the system. Colors on the right side increase in intensity until the top, at which point white is added as they continue on the left. The color bars pattern is at 75% and consists of 0% black and 100% white along the bottom, with shallow ramps directly above. Contrast, or white level, is used to set the overall lumens of the display. This pattern is symmetrical and consists of a white background with vertical rectangles from center to side, with a shallow ramp along the bottom. The corner patch is often utilized when conducting contrast measurements on local dimming displays. The configurator below allows for customizations, including patch sizes from 0 to 0.9999% for the evaluation of loading behavior. The elliptical gradient consists of a linear ramp from black to white and allows for quick assessment of quantization or bit depth of the system. The elliptical design allows more pixels on the outer edge, increasing the resolution of the gradient. 
On the 3840 by 2160 display, the outer edge resolves 12-bit values for closer analysis. The patch generator is infinitely customizable to provide solutions for all types of display technologies. The configurator has the most commonly used patch sizes readily available, or enter a custom patch size for specific use cases. The patch, background, and luminance are adjustable to create infinite combinations. The ramp is highly configurable from a stair-step pattern to a shallow ramp, and should appear gray without any color throughout. It is useful for assessing quantization artifacts, also called contouring. Waves and color within the pattern indicate system limitations or incorrect calibration. For further evaluation, the configurator allows for a combination of colors to be individually assessed. The shallow ramp pattern is a parameterized version of the brightness and contrast patterns. It allows you to focus on a small color range for quantization and color coding errors. The zone plate consists of a sine wave rotated around the center of screen. As the wave travels further from center, the frequency increases. If the intensity of the pattern diminishes as the frequency increases, the edges will lose intensity. Excessive sharpening or scaling may also result in more A. Using the configurator, the scale, color, and luminance may be tuned for further evaluation. And of course, Patterns has been highly integrated with Calman, allowing for swift collection and interpretation of larger data sets. And by connecting patterns to Calman as both the generator and the display, Calman is able to control both pattern generation while also setting the color space, making assessment of the system easier than ever before. With the ability to perform fine-tuned calibration and validate iOS and iPadOS in virtually any SDR or HDR color space, Patterns Mobile ushers in a new understanding in content creation and consumption, and we're just getting started. Thank you.